and welcome back to Breathe with Jenny. I'm here with you again today with another uh, opportunity to strengthen your shoulders. Today I'm going to take this pose in a modified hero pose using a block. Uh, this will give me an opportunity to stretch the areas uh, around my knees and maybe even feel a little bit of a quadricep or a thigh muscle um, stretch. Your choice how you want to take your lower body really is completely up to you. Again, the focus is primarily on the shoulders. If you would like to try this modified hero pose or saddle pose, you'll need at least one block, maybe two, maybe three. Uh, you might want to stack them this way. And so fo some folks like to have a little wider base so you can put a couple side by side. Again, completely up to you. I have loads of blocks at the studio, so when you come to class, don't worry about bringing any of, of them. I have plenty for you to borrow here. So here we go with modified hero pose. The block is long horizontally between my feet. And then I'm going to sit back on the block. If you've never tried this pose before, maybe you give it a try and you can decide whether or not you like to work on your shoulders from this position or something else. All right, ready to work on the shoulders again, the backs of the shoulders. We'll take our fingers and we're gonna rest them lightly on the back of our head. And we're gonna send those elbows towards the back of the room. Immediately, you're gonna feel the backs of your shoulders, your shoulder blades working. Fingers are resting lightly though on the back of your head. And what we're gonna do is alternate opening one arm and then the other. It's just basically an elbow hinge. Do this, bring it back, and then do the opposite arm. Another one of those exercises that you can do as often as you like. The more you do it, the more tired you're going to become and you may notice that the shoulders or your elbows start to go like this. That's when you have to tell yourself to send those elbows towards the back of the room. Keep that engagement in the shoulder blades. And if you meet with me, either in a class or in a private session, believe me, I'll remind you to continue to send your elbows towards the back of the room. And there you have another shoulder strengthener. Thanks for stopping by.